Hey Fight Fans, it's Zoe Nowicki here. Today I'm walking into my first session of the week. Um, Monday and Wednesdays at 9 a.m. We have technical classes where we work on a lot of jujitsu concepts to really sharpen our game. Good. Big hooks, big hooks. There you go, big hooks. This is me and my teammate, Sierra Buxton, and it's Monday night sparring and boxing, and she's gonna mess me up tonight. Right, Sierra? Always. <laughs> Finally home after some training. Get to see my puppy. Hi, come here. Hi, I missed you. Aww. Finally home and showered from Monday night training. Um, every Monday night I have sparring and boxing and MMA. And tonight we did a lot of ground and pound and I am exhausted. I love Mondays, they're my favorite. Now I'm just in my comfy outfit and my PJs, getting ready to make dinner at 9.30. <laughs> this venison sausage is from my mom. Um, I'm about out, so that's concerning. But I make it into burgers because I just like it that way better. And then I always have a little bit of fats with my avocado and then just some mixed veggies. I keep my dinner pretty light. It's late and um, it just feels good in my body after training. So when I make this sausage, I don't really season the meat because it's already been seasoned as it was packaged. But um, I do add just some salt and pepper to my veggies and some balsamic vinegar because it's so good. And I eat the exact same veggies every day, so it makes it not so boring. So this morning, I woke up kind of late for training. I pressed snooze a little too many times. We're here at one of my favorite coffee shops to pick up some coffee. Now I'm back home from my morning session at Master Perez's doing Taekwondo. I'm going to show you the breakfast I like to make. I eat this every single morning. It's a pancake recipe. I do um, six egg whites, and then I do a quarter cup of frozen blueberries, a scoop of MRE Light. It's the only protein I'll use. Um, I don't use whey because it just doesn't agree with my stomach, so I use this plant-based protein. Um, actually, I have a discount code that can get you 20% off. It's T20 Zoe, if you go to redcon1.com. Um, they do a lot of like 50% deals too. It's a really good brand. It tastes so good. It's not chalky um, and they have so many good flavors. The peanut butter cookie, my favorite one. And then I do a half cup of oats. I blend it all together. Make some really good peanut butter blueberry pancakes. Oh, perfect. 
I get so excited for this every single morning. <laughs> So Tuesdays are definitely my longest day and it's about one o'clock right now. I just took an amazing nap and I'm about to go hit my favorite lift of the week. So that's exciting. Right now I'm making my um, intra workout drink. It has electrolytes. I try to drink an electrolyte every day. Um, I drink about a gallon and a half of water a day. So I really need this to not um, over hydrate myself. I'm looking Jack right now. I'm looking Jack. I'm Thank you, Hayden. I mean, not anymore. You're 157. I was 157. Tonight? I alpha at 157. Well, now we're gonna eat. Oh, Bro, wait. I cut four pounds today. You're <laughs> a maniac. Okay, so at Applebee's, because I was forced to come here. You were forced? She yes. wanted to go to, to, come she here. to, go to Buffalo Wild Wings. I did want to go to You didn't articulate that. Anyway, you could have put we your already foot got down our food. And you could have been like, I want Buffalo Wild Wings. Not really good at expressing your opinions. Yes. Yeah. And you articulate, my. Zoe. I'm sorry, I will not. My steak, I asked for it medium rare and it was well done. But it's fine. You Zoe's, guys are happy. Zoe, stop whining. Good girl. Today is Thursday, sparring day. Uh, this is my favorite day of the week because I get to wake up and I go to my one of my favorite sessions, which is Taekwondo. And then I just kind of journal and I read and I just take the day to relax um, to get my mind right for jujitsu and sparring tonight. I don't have any extra runs or lifts or anything today. So it's a really good day for me to just chill out, get my mind right um, and get ready for sparring. And today I am so excited for sparring because I feel so rested and good. Typically my Wednesdays consist of 9 a.m. elite training and then I have a run before or after my private uh, with Tristan, my striking coach and teammate. And then I go to night classes where I do jujitsu and MMA. But yesterday I was feeling really worn down and I wanted to feel super fresh for sparring today since I'm about three, four weeks out. Um, so I just did my 9 a.m. technical session and then I went on my run and then I had my private with Tristan and I took the night off where I just ate some good food, got some good carbs in me because my weight is super good and I just chilled out. So I'm so excited for sparring tonight and I'm feeling energized and ready. I'm here just chilling on this Thursday, hanging out. New girl, our favorite show. Right. Yeah. Getting some live rounds in, prepping for the fight. This is the work that's done behind the scenes to be successful. Look at how she has to blend all of the skills together. Beautiful takedown entry. Remember, focus on one leg, Zoe. If I can get you in on one leg, you can take anyone down. 
You don't worry about the whole thing. If you find a body lock, great. If you find a double, great. But if not, shift off onto one leg and focus on it. And generally, it'll be... Beautiful, reset right back to your work. Moving that head, yeah. Flare that, flare that. Beautiful. All right, let's see that grappling turn on, Zoe. Wrestle through, wrestle through. Nice, good. Pin that shoulder down to the mat. She's not gonna Kimura you from there unless she gets in the side, so keep your base. Hit that man, Zoe. Yeah, it's under you. Just got done with Thursday night. Now we do our meditation group. Um, missing a few people today. Just journal, and then we meditate, and then we talk about it. I figured I would show you guys um, one of my new favorite snacks I found. I actually just discovered it Tuesday after my lift. I decided that I would make up this concoction um i usually just have an apple but this was so good i thought i would have this for my morning snack so um i just put a piece of gluten free bread in my air fryer this is my favorite brand i get it from aldi and i got this sweet potato hummus it's just sweet potato olive oil lemon juice and then some um like seasonings like salt and stuff so i was like, oh, trying to think of things that would be good on because I don't really eat chips or anything. Um, I was dipping my sweet potatoes in it, in the sweet potato hummus. Um, but really, it just tastes like, it does taste like hummus. So, I was thinking, you know, what could I make this with? And uh, Tuesday, I decided for my post-training carbs that this would be perfect. I have my bread and sweet potatoes, carbs. So, I did this, and then um, I cut up some cherry tomatoes. Well, actually, first, I put spinach on there, which I couldn't decide if I liked or not, but I think I do. Um, it just gives it something else. I don't know. Um, yeah. That's just way easier. So, this is what it looks like. And then I put this camp mix on it, which is just salt, pepper, um, garlic, just to give it a little something, not be just plain. Mm. So I help coach at a high school just south of my gym called Whitmore Lake. Nice room. Good kids. Um, they're all fun to work with. I was gonna be here a lot more often, but then fight camp started about right when their season started. So I'm not here as often because I have to keep my energy levels up and wrestling with them, drilling them, teaching them does take a lot of energy. Um, but I like it. I like staying involved. So I'm here like two to three days a week when I can be. Um, yeah. Hello, today is Saturday. Um, I love my Saturdays. I usually get up in the morning and I go do some technical work with jujitsu. Um, and then I have a couple girls that I run a wrestling private with. Um, they're little like 11 year old girls. Um, so that's a lot of fun. And I like doing that every Saturday. I love coaching. Like I said, it keeps me involved. Um, and I love working one on one with people. Just getting ready for my job at Jonah's Bar and Grill in Howell, Michigan. Bartender and a server. I work usually Saturdays and Sundays and sometimes Fridays. And I make really good cash doing that. So I do that and I do my wrestling privates. Um, and that's kind of how my week looks. Good. <laughs> so awkward. <laughs> 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 Is my face in that? 
So today is Sunday, and a normal Sunday for me looks like getting up in the morning, um, going to coffee, and coming to morning elite practice. But this Sunday is a little different because we had a huge training session we were doing, um, and I was running a wrestling portion for it. So got up in the morning, had some breakfast with Kate and Fallon Johnson, a couple of my teammates here, and then we had a few hours of training a couple hours of jiu-jitsu, a couple hours of wrestling, and then a couple hours of um, striking. Normally I work today, uh, I work at the bar, but I got the day off to hang out with these ladies. Left, but it was a huge group. I got amazing rounds in, and I'm so happy about this clinic we did. Um, we're planning on doing one every three months, so exciting news. And Sunday is one of my most favorite days of the week because it is my refeed day. So what my refeed day is, is I eat pretty much the same thing every day of, of the week. Um, and then Sunday, I eat a bunch of extra calories, a bunch of extra, mostly carbs, um, to kind of, it's just a high carb day to get me through the week. Um, but today was a really weird day because of the girls clinic. So I'm super behind on my food. It's like 536 and I'm eating pretty much my second meal of the day. We trained for five hours today, so it was hard to get everything in. I... This morning we went to breakfast, I had a big breakfast. I had like a four egg veggie omelet with hash browns um, and I brought some gluten-free toast. So that got me started off right, but then I only had like a granola bar and a banana and it was just not good. So now it's like 6 p.m. and I'm having my next meal. Um, this gluten-free, dairy-free pizza from um, their Lifesavers. I love their pizzas, and I will probably eat most of this because I'm supposed to go out and eat again tonight. So, and then I'll eat again before bed, most likely. So, yeah, Sundays are definitely uh, exciting for me. So, Ty and I came to the log cabin to try it out. Um, as you already know, it's my refeed day, and I completely destroyed this. I didn't even get to vlog at first, so... Hey guys, I really hope you enjoyed this vlog and getting a little sneak peek into my life leading up to um, my fight and all the hard work I put in. Make sure you tune in. Um, we'll post the link on Facebook, but you tune in to my fight uh, this Friday, January 6th. The fight starts at 6 p.m. and I am the co-main event. So make sure you check it out and thank you for all your support.